and an amazing food out to you guys to that idea it's lunch time all right i got some vegetable vegetable fish now i'm gonna kick it off right now I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you exactly what you need to do to make this one an amazing one today guys this is fantastic and i love the one that i did all right now that's my frying pan right here okay um yeah hopefully you guys can see exactly what i'm doing all right if not um yeah so hope you guys can see exactly what chef ricardo been doing nice and lovely in the kitchen with chef ricardo this morning yeah. all right yeah 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 so this one gonna be a simple one all right it's not gonna be like something complicated in the morning you can eat those things together vegetable on fish all right this is some codfish i brought in the supermarket and i want to do something fantastic with it this morning all right as you can see for yourself that's looking really good fantastic and amazing all right yeah part two uh, i did a, i did i think i did a video on that one before okay well what i'm gonna do i'm gonna be doing another video on it to show you guys lunch time now and i want to eat something okay yeah i've been working hard from morning man we've been putting a lot of work into this thing for it to work you know so for us to for it for us to make it work we have to put in the work that's how i look at it if you want it to work you have to put in the work all right guys now as you, as you can see all right i'm gonna show you exactly what to do to make this an amazing dish today i got the arrival it is here all right so if you want to get the arrival go over to caribbean fusion sauce and spice website and get the arrival okay it's a season that's what i'm going to be using on my fish today now what i'm going to do i'm going to pop roughly about two tablespoons of olive oil inside of a frying pan okay two tablespoons is good to go in the frying pan all right that, that's looking good all right as you can see it for yourself that's looking amazing so now to be honest with you here it is the arrival is here now this is the fish i'm gonna be using some cod fish i'm gonna be using all right a little bit more heat i didn't want to put in i didn't want to get a little bit hot put a little bit more heat on it all right but it's fine I still kind of fried like this. When you put in oil, fish in the oil is the pot supposed to be hot. All right, guys. Yeah, one hundred percent. It's supposed to be hot. Okay. Well, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna show you exactly what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna um, simple. Share this on an amazing recipe with you. So right here, I got the, the the arrival. I'm gonna put a little bit of it on it like this. Not much, just a little bit of the arrival is um vegan friendly low in salt and all them stuff the very very nice season from the caribbean fusion sauce and spice website you can go to their website and you can get this okay yeah turn over to this side i'm gonna put a little bit on a season normally you see chef ricardo normally use a lot of season and stuff sometimes I do not do that. Sometimes I just try my best to just do stuff on a different kind of way. But look at that. Beautiful. You know what I mean? You don't need... Sometimes you have to cook like this, guys. Trust me. You know? Yeah. Lovely and nice. So once the oil and the season mix together, what we're going to do, I'm just going to just pop a little bit of salt because I'm going to need some salt. The more salt, less. That is lovely. What I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna cover it because it's gonna be splashing all over the whole place. Just to fry it nicely and make it steam nicely. Alright. Yeah. Beautiful one. Trust me. Sometimes guys you have to just cook certain kind of way. 
I pull them, you know what I mean? Now, let's put this one in here. Alright, that's for the fish. When I fry it, I'm gonna put it right on top of it. Lovely. So, but as you can see, that looking fantastic, amazing, right there. All right. Big up my audience on Instagram and Facebook at the moment. Thank you guys for tuning in. Wow! Look at that. You know, the turn over the fish. You know what I mean? Just like this. Alright, trust me. Sometimes you don't want to have too much season and all that thing there. Like. Just want to just keep it simple. Alright, yeah, so we're just going to fry up this. You get a nice color. Smell that fish. Smell amazing. That's the only thing I don't like. It's too much oil all over the whole place when you're cooking, you know? Yeah. But well, it's a beautiful one. Alright. Juliet, thank you so much for coming on the show. Uh, Ricardo, big, big up yourself, another Ricardo again. You know what I mean? That is lovely. Ah, smell it. So, the arrival, guys, the only thing I'm saying to you with the arrival, you don't need to add anything to eat it. Once you put this on it, God is having probably about 18 different kind of seasoning inside of it. And I'm also salt free, low in salt, and also vegan friendly. All right, so basically, this is amazing. All right, fantastic. Well, I'm just making steam, and that's exactly what you want to do, you know. Yeah, looking good. And it's when it's, it's cooking, so you want to when you're cooking it like this, trust me. Yeah, it's beautiful one, guys. Beautiful, beautiful one idea. Jackie, good morning. Nice to see you. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Please share the video, guys, and tell a friend and a friend, tell a friend. Alright. So we just want it to get a nice, lovely color. And then what we're going to do, we're going to shear it up, put some vegetable and shear it up all right lovely one let's keep my eye on it but look at that wow wow let's take that feet all right that looking good so that look nice all right so basically it's cooking like this i do the reason why i cover it to be honest with you it's gonna be messing up everywhere when you're frying the fish and that's where i was running from but i didn't want to put any flour any coating and anything on it you put a little bit of flour to keep it together but i don't like that so i want to just cook it like this all right and trust me it's lovely when you cook it like that wow smell that fish man that smell uh so what we're gonna do i'm gonna put it one side and trust me the eating the fish I'm gonna cook on his, on his own. So right here I have a medium sized frying pan. All right, so what I'm gonna, I'll put it at the back. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just turn on my heat at the back. I make it go on, simple cook it because I do not wanna have too much season on it and all these things. I just want to use the arrival on it because the arrival is very good. I do not wanna put too much season on it. And, you know what I mean? I want it to just be simple. Very, very simple. Right here, I got a medium sized front pan. Just chuck a little bit of butter inside of it. Not much. Um, no, oil. I'm using some olive oil. A little bit of olive oil inside of it. Alright, look at this, guys. This is going to be amazing. Alright, lovely. So I got two cups of garlic. Chuck that garlic inside of it. 
all right i make it burn into the oil see that that's what you want to do you want it to burn into the oil look at that once it burns into the oil the garlic into the oil well trust me do not do this what i'm doing guys if you unless you're cooking outside because i don't want you to mess up your whole kitchen so you want to burn the oil into the garlic very good for you garlic and the oil all right you see that yeah beautiful now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put a, a medium size on and turn on this. Turn on this a little bit. Now it's a little bit too high. Cut down the heat a little bit to about four. Cause it's a little bit high at the moment. Alright. So red we're gonna put some red onion inside of it. And let that red onion fry up very hot and nice. Look at that. Beautiful. That looks good. This, look at that. So that looking nice. So I'll take off the red one in. We got some tomato. We got, we got the three different color peppers red green and gold that's your favorite all right look at that beautiful so that look nice colorful and nice isn't it yeah That is lovely. Some fresh thyme. Some spring onion. Let's break up a spring onion. Check it straight inside of it. Look at that. And guys, look at that vegetable. Very lovely and nice. Now I have some mixed vegetables with some cabbage it's like a Chinese stir fry vegetables so I'm gonna just chop that straight inside of it make sure you wash it off when you buy it from the supermarket all right all I'm gonna need on this one is a little bit of salt all right and a little bit of black pepper Trust me, I don't want to eat have any much too much things in it, you know. I just want to keep it simple, to be honest with you. You know what I mean? Um now this is my favorite one I start to use now. I'm using some cloves. So I'm gonna put roughly about one, two, three, four or five, five of them inside of it. Alright? You can get this in your local shop or your supermarket to buy cloves. Let's chuck it straight inside of it. I'm gonna give it a lovely flavor. And it's good for you guys. Really, really good for you. So nowadays when you're cooking. If you can put two of that inside of it, that will be really good. And chuck yourself a lovely uh, bay leaf inside of it. All right. Grab yourself some bay leaf. Here it is. This and chuck inside of it and cook it with it. Lovely, healthy, and delicious and nice. I'm using some olive oil. All right. Now, get yourself some lemon juice and squeeze upon it. All right, nice one. Some lemon juice inside of it. Beautiful. And now, Chef Ricardo is going to have this for lunch. All right, lots of vegetable. What left, you just put it into your fridge and you can have it another day. Do not waste the food. So, it's looking what's going on. Things looking good. So, we're just going to cover this and allow it for it to steam for a few minutes. The fish is good so this is not like one of those kind of cooking the chef I just want to try to do it a little bit a little bit a healthier way all right so the arrival you have to have a little bit of salt in it it doesn't have no whole heap of stuff inside of it it's also vegan friendly and it's very good for you 
All right, beautiful one. Um, the fish can turn off. Yeah, that's it with the fish. All right, yeah, fish looking good, 100%. All right, guys, yeah. That is it right now so far. But as you can see, this looking amazing. And trust me, the vegetable, wow, can't go wrong with vegetable, guys. You know what I mean? Eat a lot of vegetables, they're good to go. All right, look at that. Oh, yeah, don't come out of the pot. That's looking amazing. That is fantastic, guys, and that's exactly what I'm talking about. All right, now what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna grab myself a plate. Make sure you have some avocado. All right, because you need some avocado in this and an amazing food. All right, yeah, you have to have some avocado, guys. Trust me. You're gonna see how this is looking so good when I finish with it. It's gonna be lovely and also delicious. And in the meantime, you just go and drink some bottled water. Mm -hmm. 100% all right shout out to every one of you guys who are watching and you know I mean enjoying this episode from chef record if you notice I put lemon juice and I put some cloves inside of this one and you know what I mean so yeah very very good for you healthy and delicious man you can't go wrong with veg you know yeah yeah let's put a little bit more heat on it you know yeah man that's amazing. Look at that. Wow. That's amazing. Just keep it simple. You know, sometimes you want to do something simple because every time you want to eat this whole heap of spicy food and all them stuff there, this is fabulous right here. 100%. This is amazing. Get the arrival, guys. It's here. Get it. Go to Caribbean Fusion Sauce and Spice website and grab on it and support your black local business. Okay? Yeah, man. That looking fabulous, guys. That is fantastic and amazing. All right? Yeah. So if you like the arrival, jump on it and get it. It's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful one from Chef Ricardo this morning. Yeah, that looking good. Wow, guys, look at that. So that look nice. Look at the color of the vegetable. Everything is just amazing. All right, that's amazing at the moment, guys. Trust me. <laughs> All right, now what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna turn off the cooker and load and eat for it to cook it. Okay. All right, that's it. Gonna just go inside of it and just finish it off. Beautiful, 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 beautiful one. All right, yeah. As you can see it for yourself, and that's exactly what Chef Ricardo talking about. When you make it a nice, lovely meal, yeah, man, you can't go wrong. All right, yeah. Similar, like, man. Similar, so good. All right. Now, did you see the reason why I put the thyme, the, the lemon in it? Cause the lemon, what the lemon do is to keep everything fresh and nice. All right. That's why I see it looks so good. All right. Now let's try this one. Hmm. Just a little bit more. Yeah, put too much salt in it. Yeah. Nicely. Now, this is this is almost finished. 
All right. Let's share it up. Yes. This is going to be one of those kind of meals where you have to want to try at home, guys. There's no way you can set a chef ricotta. Wow. I'm, I, I'm, you know what I mean? You have to. All right. Let's share up this amazing food from Chef Ricardo cooking today. All right. Beautiful, lovely, and delicious. All right. Let me see if you guys can see exactly what I do. Now, look at this. All right, guys. Look at this. Now, I want you guys to see what I'm going to do right now. Let's get this thing together. What's going on right here? Let's get this thing together. All right. Yeah. So, no, that one is, oh yeah, that is perfect. All right. Yeah, that much better. I think there's a block in this one. All right, lovely. Now, all right, my Facebook audience now. Let me see what I go on. I'm going to see what I go on. Now I'm going to see it 100% good, but I'm trying my best to show you. Now, this is the plate, okay? And look at this. And you guys can do this at home. Get yourself some vegetable. Steam vegetable like this. Some beautiful steam vegetable too. Alright. This is for lunch. Okay. Trust me. Lunch. I'm going to talk about lunch. Not dinner. You know what I mean? For dinner time you can have fruits. It depends on starvation. No way. You might just a chef for cut away. You work too hard for you. You sit there. All right, that is lovely. Now, get that amazing fish which we just fry. Look at this. And I, you know what happened with the fish? I tried to cook it a simple way where it does not even. Wow, I know it was gonna break still because you know them fish. I saw them fish stay when you cook them. Them have to when you cook your fish if it not break up something wrong. All right, yeah, you have to make the fish kind of get a little bit of break. All right, so. That it's right there, that's the fish. Alright, now get your avocado. Alright, as you can see for yourself. Alright. Look at guys, just want you to look good enough because this kind of video doesn't come. It's only one at a time, Chef Ricardo. I'm gonna do this kind of video. Get yourself some avocado, which is local. You don't have to fly to Jamaica to get avocado, guys. Trust me. Right in England you can get it. All right, get yourself an avocado. All right, beautiful and nice, and just resi on top of it, like this. All right, that's the avocado. Now, look in your fridge. You must have lemon or lime in your fridge, okay? If you have, if you have lemon or lime, just grab yourself some lemon or some lime, and you know, yeah. That's it. If you got some parsley, get yourself some parsley and put on it. This is just a simple one from Chef Ricardo this evening for you guys. Very healthy and delicious meal for the day. And you guys can definitely try this out. Black pepper. Okay. And then, where it is? That other one. That one is amazing. Any food you put this on, it's such a good one. You can use this on anything. Thank you for watching, stay tuned in, and that's a very healthy, healthy, healthy one from Chef Ricardo today. Again, with this, another amazing one right here from Chef Ricardo. Alright, so please enjoy it and subscribe to the YouTube channel as you can see it for yourself. I try my best to give you some of the world best healthy food. Alright, the, the lemon and the, the lemon and the cloves makes the difference in this meal. Alright, so please try it at home. And you know what I mean, make it for your husband, your girlfriend, whatever. Try something different. Sometimes we have to cut off as too much of them powder season where we make. These one guys where you see I'm using, these are healthy seasons. It's just bay um natural herbs in them. You know? I went to um a shop, I went to someone house the other day for, to to drop off some stuff. And they were showing me in their cupboard. And when I look in the cupboard, it's bay powder seasoning. Bay powder seasoning. Everything within cook is beer powder. Yeah, sometimes you have to cut back and just use some natural stuff. 
all right like this one now if you notice it said vegan friendly okay and it's also low in salt all right so you have to add a little bit of salt to yourself so sometimes you're gonna some house chuck out some of the powder season guys they got too much powder season at the house in the cupboard everything you are cooked pan i be at this you see be a powder get yourself some some of them um not you can get yourself some paprika paprika is very good um mix herb right now guys if i show you my cupboard if i show you my cupboard you would never see none of those plastic thing where you see when you're going to house are you hoping they they cupboard is be a powder season and i can show you in my cupboard right now there's nothing like that no powders you will see seasoning but these seasoning are like i have a lot of these this is where i mostly use right here look at these guys i'm gonna show you there are these i have in my cupboard and i have a little bit of salt right here look at this basley the water these you know what i mean organic um rosemary and all them stuff there Be guys you know you need to chuck out some of those powder season at the cupboard too much powder season in the cupboard all right now when i go to the shop this is the only one i normally buy from that shop from that company this one you can see the color is the pepper i will buy the whole grain pepper that i'm gonna show the name all right you don't know the package of this company <laughs> guys yeah start use natural seasoning natural seasoning and cut out some of those powder seasoning and use a lot of herbs and stuff yes you want your food for taste nice but every time you're cooking you're using a be at this chicken lamb pork fish i just use just this and a little bit of olive oil and my fish and look at that anyway thank you for watching stay tuned tune in and i love every one of you guys and i will see you with another video and god bless you all have a beautiful day guys trust me all right see you next time in the kitchen with more recipe big up on yourself nicole big up yourself. thank you so much to come in on the show really appreciate it and the other rest of people who are supporting chef ricardo thank you so much guys for watching my facebook page thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys with another video all right big up on yourself i'm gonna eat some lunch now and you know what i mean as i said lunch time yeah man a lunch time right now but as you can see for yourself guys look at that all right just take a good look simple stir fry vegetable and some fish with lemon and avocado avocado is very good for you all right anyway i will see you next time another video bye bye